You're listening to TF Talk News, part of the TF Talk network of podcasts and live streams, where we give you the most relevant current stories in your fandom and more, all within 30 quick minutes or less. I'm your host, Mr. Starscream, and I'll be your guide to everything worth talking about that transformed since last episode. Discover more of our great shows at tftalk.net and follow us on social media channels at tfylp. Welcome to this abridged edition of TF Talk News. There just wasn't a lot of toy news this week, except for the major bombshell of TFCon Orlando being canceled this past Thursday. If you recall last week, I highlighted the fact that the airfare and hotel costs for attending this convention were dropping amidst the COVID-19 fears sweeping the nation. Unfortunately, it appears I will in fact not be going to Disney World. Nor will I attend TFCon, since the organizers had to make the disappointing and difficult decision to pull the plug on the event. Ultimately, this decision was made with the public's best interest in mind, and no one should fault them for it. A lot changes in a week, and this outcome became inevitable with each passing day. The TFCon staff remains vigilant, though, and has promised to provide an update on the next location for TFCon USA next weekend, when it was expected to be announced after the commencement of TFCon Orlando. Maybe next time, Florida man. We still have no word on alternate release plans for MP10 ADC Atmos Duck Camo Convoy, but as soon as I hear something, I'll let you know. I mean, that is after I've, you know, made sure I got my own first. There may not be many regular household goods in your local stores, but the toy aisle is still looking pretty healthy. There weren't any new reveals hitting shelves, but lots is expected to start arriving in April. Specifically, Studio Series Voyager, Sentinel Prime, and Constructicon Scrapper. Keep your eyes peeled and save some rube in your shopping cart amidst the bottled water and toilet paper that is bound to last you until about 2021. Tomorrow, March 15th, at 7 a.m. Eastern, Season 3 of Cyberverse, titled Bumblebee Cyberverse Adventures, will air on the Cartoon Network. It's been made very clear that this is the final season of this animated series, and the tone appears to be turning a bit darker. Expect a lot of new characters like Windwheel, Thunderhowl, and Hammerstrike as the story comes to a close. To commemorate this new show, the staff at the TF Talk Network will be hosting a watch-along Cyberverse marathon of the first two seasons, and will be giving commentary for the entire 36-episode run of the show. The stream begins Sunday, March 15th, starting around 10 a.m. Central. If you are behind on the show, this is a great opportunity to use your forced time off to catch up on some great animation and feel like a kid again. And we could all use that right about now, right? The stream will be running all day Sunday on the TFYLP YouTube page. Well, thanks for tuning in to TF Talk News during this unprecedented time. Just remember, toilet paper rolls run out. But plastic crack lasts forever. It's cosmic rust. Impossible. Only organic forms of life can be infected by disease. Crimson!